Now we're at the SRS booth, and uh, Dan Tinker's here, the CEO of SRS, and uh, you guys are growing Howdy, so fast. We are growing. We, uh, we're adding about 100 branches to the network almost uh, every year now, and it's uh, up to 750 locations wow. in 47 states, so we're pretty proud of the growth. Obviously, with that amount of growth, how are you guys seeing the, the contractors respond to uh, working with you guys? Well, look, our mission statement is uh, make money, have fun, and give back. You see that in everything we do from our, our booth, our exhibits, our training, our Paralatino Lounge, our concert, our foundation. You know, uh, look, the bottom line is our company was founded on a principle that we don't win if our contractors don't win. So our investment is in the best talent and people we can have in our company to support and serve the best contractors in the country. And if we can help them run better businesses, grow faster than their competition and their partners with us, then we by default actually grow with our customers. So our job is really in the customer growth business, not not to always gain customers, but to help our customers grow in their own markets. And as a result, we grow with them. And it, that alignment is so cr critical, I feel like, to your as a success. And it's really not what we see from a lot of distribution. I mean, it's always kind of been the distribution versus the contractor. And you guys have really partnered with with your contractors and your customers to create that that opportunity for them. Yeah, I think that's because we have a very long-term view of the world. I mean, we're not in it to win an order today. In fact, I always tell our sales team, if, if you're not willing to tell a contractor you actually shouldn't buy from SRS for a certain product because it probably isn't the right thing to buy from us, right. then you're not really being a true partner and they can't really trust you. If you're just trying to be greedy and win every order and you really don't have the contractor's best interest in mind, they're going to see through that and eventually you're going to be transactional and you're not going to be a strategic partner. So our goal is to really be a strategic business ally and a partner and invest in those companies very much from not just a relationship but a really tied in strategic partnership and that's just how our view is we're here to be in it for the next decade or decades not the next you know 10 days and winning orders in the short term so i think our longer term view helps us and being private not public we don't have that pressure of having any near term issues with having to need orders today versus you know helping people grow business over the long term that's awesome and I, as contractors i think sometimes we don't realize that there's all these awesome opportunities that you guys provide mm -hmm. to help us grow our businesses. Yeah. What are some of the tools that we should be looking at when we're trying to grow our business that you guys provide that maybe we're just not paying attention to? Yeah, that's a great question. I'd say, you know, a few things. First is um, embrace technology. We're really investing a lot in digital and, and tying into contractor CRMs and providing the best resources of allowing all contractors to move to the digital world. And everything's about speed, pace, and 24-7 yeah. access. So contractors can order material on Sunday afternoon or evening at their kitchen table from us. Our branches aren't even open and order all their materials for the whole week. They can do it all from their phone. They can do it from a laptop, whatever. They can be out on a job site and don't even have to come off the roof and get awesome. more materials. So it's all about, you know, ease of doing business and making the customers, uh, you know, job and life easier. Um, but I think technology one, the other is our training programs. I mean, uh, unparalleled, I think we invest more in training than most distributors do. Everything from how to help contractors sell more, how to get leads and convert them into wins, awesome. how to make more profit margin on each job, and also how to just be more efficient and tie into us to where we help them save labor savings because of the fact that they can see our truck coming down the road and they're not sending crews out there waiting on our material to be at the job site. So. Again, it all goes back to integration, technology, talent, training, uh, all those tools. But the key is to get them engaged and ask their sales reps with SRS, what all do you, what all can you offer me that I'm not tapping into and make sure they understand all the suite of products and training and technology and support we can give them. I love that. And the value that that brings to the contractor for having that relationship with you guys is huge. And I think a lot of contractors don't understand that value a lot of times. And the more that you're able to really take advantage of these opportunities with your distribution partner, the more that you're going to be able to grow your business. And SRS is by far doing a great job above above the rest as far as doing those things. Yeah, we like to think so. We really, again, like I said, it's not about us arguing over $1 a square, what something should cost. I always tell people, if I can teach you how to sell it for $10 more a square, then it doesn't really matter what you pay for us a dollar a square difference, uh, higher or lower, but you may be paying a dollar a dollar higher from us to get more services that you really need and want, yep. but it makes you a more profitable company in the end. So yeah. just don't think of it as a zero sum game. Yeah. No, it, it's there's so much more there and it's, yeah. uh, it's about understanding the value here. And this is a great opportunity for you guys. If you haven't 
reached out to your local SRS rep, I encourage you to start with them. They're probably your best source to get all the knowledge and understand what's really going on within the space and all the tools that they can offer you and build that relationship. That relationship is so important, I feel like. That rep and the contractor relationship it is, is crucial. I mean, we, we don't. We want our reps to be your trusted advisor. They should be almost like an internal consultant for your company for everything. Remember, our reps call on about a hundred contractors, so they have best practices to share from the best of the best. Whether it's financing options, whether it's sales training, whether it's how to manage labor, whether it's how to manage lead generation, whatever it is, or getting into new products. We we teach contractors that only do residential how to get into commercial. We teach people that want to get into solar how to do solar. So, don't don't be uh, hold back on anything you want us to help you try to grow and expend, extend your business. I love it. And best part is if you do get to be a part of the SRS family and buy material from these guys, they throw some ridiculous parties. <laughs> we do. Okay. The Las Vegas Bowl is always a blast. We've gone now three years in a row. Yep. Some of the best concerts I've ever seen and just some of the most intimate concerts I've ever been to. Last sure. night we saw Leonard Skinner at House of Blues and it was I mean, he was 25 feet away from it, me. It was over the top. We raised over a quarter of a million dollars for charity. And that's the thing I, I, I want to urge people. Like, we're a company that you should be proud to be doing business with. We're, we, are 100, well, we have 100% of our employees that are owners of the company. They own about 25% of the company. So all 11,000 people, every truck driver, every warehouse person you come in contact with, every counter person, every outside salesperson, every manager, they're all co-owners of this company, which means they care more. It's their company, not just... Uh, a public company or some investors company. This is a employee led and owned company and they that's a big deal. We also give back and we have our own foundation giving about $15 million to charity over the last 10 years. So we're a company you should be proud to be associated with all the way around. The way we treat our people, our customers and our suppliers uh, as partners and family. I love it. Dan, always an honor. Thank you yeah. so much for everything you do. John, and, uh, thanks for having me. Absolutely.